Okay, no, it's been a long time since I recorded one of these, but today I'm going to be showing how to RNG manipulate for a shiny starter in Pokemon Emerald. Uh, literally taught myself how to do it again right before this video, but yeah, uh, let's get into it. So, this is for MGBA emulator. So, let me just open my copy. Okay, so we have my game. I already progressed through just just enough to get to the starter selection. So, right here. You want to save right in front of this, but from here, you're going to want to go to Tools, Scripting, File, and I'm just going to load my most recent uh, because I was already on the right script. A uh, link to this script will be in the description. Uh, so, let me just... No, why is it doing it that way? Okay, do this, do this. Let me space it out like that. There we go. So now we're going to progress through, and we're going to click here, and we're just going to pick any of them. It doesn't matter. The only reason we're doing this is because we need our TID and SID over here. So from this, we open up. Uh, give me a second. I got to get to it. I'll just put a cut here. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't know where my Pokefinder window was. This will also be in the description. So go to Pokefinder, Gen 3, and we're going to hit Static. And we can minimize that because it opens up this window. And I already set up the profile, but I'll show you how to set one up. So you literally just hit Manager, New, and then Version, set that to Emerald, Profile Name, whatever you want to. And then TID and SID, you just enter those in the here, which is exactly what uh, I did here. So, because right, I've already got my entered, and let's go for... Well, we can't go for the Gen 2 starters, because this is a fresh save, but we'll go for a shiny Trico. Uh, so, actually, we'll do Torchic, because I did Trico before this video to test it. So, Torchic, Star Square, uh, just, that, ju that just says that we don't care what type of shiny it is. Uh, seed is zero, because in Pokemon Emerald, the seed is always zero, because they messed it up, but... So now, we're just going to generate. And it says I can get one, a one at 2527, which is really early, which is good. Because if you get unlucky and uh, this number, you don't get one as early as this, you're going to have to wait a long time to get a shiny. Or you're just going to have to re-roll until you get a decent TID and SID. But let me just keep this to the side over here. And advance is, is what we want to monitor up there. So, we're going to reload this, speed through some stuff, get to the screen, and right here, you can create a save state. I guess it really doesn't matter because it's not like you can lose this seed, but I'll create one just in case. So, 2527 is what I'm aiming for. So, speed through that. Oh, control P to pause the game, then you can do control N to go frame by frame. So two, five, two, seven. Okay. Then you can hold down your A button and, and unpause at the same time. By default, your A button should be X on the keyboard. So hold down X, then press Control P. And, well, let me speed through this. We didn't get a shiny, but that's, that's okay. So from here, you can use this program I wrote. Very simple program. Uh, it's on my GitHub. It'll be in the description. But target frame, 2527. 252. You honestly don't need this program. It's just simple math that it just does for you because I got tired of doing it myself. But our target frame was 2527. And then our hit frame, we're going to figure that out by looking at the stats over here. So wasn't wasn't a shiny. Its nature is impish. So we'll go over here, select impish. Its hidden power is flying. And we're going to generate, and we're going to scroll through until we get around to our frame. And it's PID 9CD45753. Uh, 9CD4. Okay, so it looks like this is the frame. So if we can put the second number in, it's just a, some simple subtraction to s figure out what frame we hit. Uh, and it was literally just a, fr a three day. Ugh. <laughs> it was literally just a three frame difference, so we just need to aim for 2524. I think the uh, 
the 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 frame difference between the number that Pokefinder gives you and the frame difference between uh what actual start what actual frame you need to hit to get the shiny starter is always three, but this is just something you can use for future RNG manipulation. I use it all the time for RNG manipulation. But now we know that we need to go for two five two four. So I'm just going to once again reload my save. Speed through this. Oh wait, I created a save state. Whatever, it's fine. Uh, because seed's always the same. So, try speed through the game a little bit. Don't want to miss my frame on accident. Okay. Control P to pause. Control N to advance. Two, five, two, four. Same as what my little program says. Hold down X, Control P. And you can already see it at the side in the little Lua script, but if we wait to see it in game, uh, there you go, shiny starter. Pretty simple. Uh, yeah, that's all there is to it. Really simple. Uh, hope that helps anybody. I know I kind of yapped in this one, but well, I guess I yap in all the videos. But uh, yeah, hope this helped.